Hi, everybody. This is God Sad. Hope that your weekend has gone off smoothly. Several years ago, I wrote an article on my Psychology Today column titled The Narcissism and Grandiosity of Celebrities, which I subsequently turned into a sad truth clip. I'll provide the link at the end of uh, the current clip. In that article, I refer to why it is the case that many celebrities seek to save the world. And I argued, among other things, that they suffer from a form of existential guilt. They know that deep down uh, they're frauds who don't deserve all the adulation and wealth and you know prestige that is accrued to them. And so they save the world. They, you know, they... They, they save the environment, they create a more tolerant society and so on. It's all complete nonsense, uh, but it makes them be able to you know, sleep better at night. Along those lines, I just posted some comments regarding not just celebrities, but more generally the ruling elite class uh, along the same lines to explain why it is that they are so much more virtuous, caring and loving than you are. So here we are. Uh, listen to it carefully because it truly explains the entire dynamics of uh, what we see in the world today. So here we go. Let me explain yet again the source for all the platitudinous virtue signaling. The truly privileged elites know that deep down they are frauds. They suffer from existential guilt. Hence, one of the ways by which they assuage the guilt albatross around their necks is to demonstrate to the world that they are truly compassionate, truly loving, truly caring, truly profound. Hence, they love all undocumented immigrants. They love Mother Earth. They love the ozone layer. They love BLM. They love socialism. They love inner cities. They hate the gentrification of neighborhoods. They love mentors of color. They cherish diversity. They love LGBTQ movies. They adore queer architecture. They are better than you. More caring, more cultured, more empathetic. This permits them to sleep better at night. See, I'm not a fraud. I may be a gargantuan parasitic hedge fund bullshitter, but I really care. I may be an overpaid BS actor, but I fight for solar panels. Those flyover rubes, you know, down there deserve their lot in life. They are racists who bed their siblings. We are science supporters who fight against Mother Earth rapists while flying in our private jets. It is a classic ego defensive strategy that permits the ruling class to exist within their fractured selves. Save this thread. Memorize it. I am offering you a deep psychological explanation of our times. And if decent people don't wake up against what is taking place, you will wake up and say, what happened to my liberties? What happened to my freedoms? Why do I no longer live in a true democracy? I keep warning you, don't sit idly. Don't subcontract your voice to others. Get engaged in the battle of ideas. Cheers, everybody.